The Right Honorable Robin Anambanja, the Prime Minister of Uganda, has revealed that a section of missing people are hardcore criminals and are said to be prosecuted. She made the revelation yesterday after a closed-door security meeting with members of the opposition and other stakeholders over abductions and kidnappings of Ugandans by security agencies at the office of the Deputy Speaker of Parliament, Honorable Thomas Tayewa. Nabanja says some of the criminals have been identified and others are yet to be identified. Now, speaking to the media after the meeting, the leader of opposition in parliament, the Right Honorable Matthias Mbuga, threatened that an alternative report on the same issue would be tabled in case government fails to deliver the report as promised during the meeting. <laughs> Now, the very first minister of finance in President Museveni's government, Dr. Crispus Chiyonga, who is currently the NRM chairperson in Kasese district, has blasted President Museveni's government for its failure to kick corruption out of the country. Dr. Chiyonga's acknowledgement came as party leaders gathered for special prayers to mark 37 years in power. Well, he requested religious leaders to guide the president whenever it's necessary so that he doesn't commit mistakes. Now, retired General David Sejusa has come out to hit at arrogant public officers living costly and luxurious lifestyles. He pointed out over posting photos in expensive hotels and places like Dubai, you know, to him this is very wrong, especially when one has beggars in their constituency. Even if the money was earned legitimately, it's just not the right thing to do. And by the way, right now, this is like a trend in Uganda that cannot be separated with both politicians from government and the opposition. For example, the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Monk, recently gifted her husband, Moses Magogo, with a brand new Range Rover as a birthday gift. Even Minister Haruna Kasolo, a few days ago during his wedding, he gifted his bride a brand new Range Rover. So, retired General David Sejusa says this expensive and luxurious lifestyle must stop, especially if you're a public servant. I don't know what to make of this story, but that's it on the Buzz UG for now. And uh, in case you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe, but also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fuller, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.